So this is a cochlear implant. And if you clicked on this video, you're probably interested in this. Um, this is one of our only medical devices that can provide restoration of a sense. So people with profound hearing loss are eligible to get this device. And I think it's really cool. It's one of the main reasons why I became a otologist who is a ear and nose throat doctor who specializes in hearing um, and ears. And I just love the idea that for someone with really bad hearing, they could get one of these implanted in a couple hours and then have the journey to start having hearing after probably many years of not having hearing itself. So let me kind of talk you through how we do this. A um, couple components. Here is one of the receivers. And then at the very end, there is this little tiny squibble. And this little guy goes into the cochlea itself. Um, what that means. Here is our ear. This is Earl the ear. Very beautiful. Sound wave comes in. It hits the eardrum and the eardrum moves back and forth. It hits a few ear bones. And at that point, it gets into this thing called the cochlea. And it kind of looks like a snail with some loops on it. The loops are actually kind of called the vestibular system, semicircular canals. And that actually tells your brain where you are in space when you're moving around. But what we're talking about is actually the middle guy right here, the snail. The idea with the cochlear implant is that we very meticulously put this little electrode and it'll get it inside the cochlea and kind of wrap it around. And the idea is that it provides electrical stimulation to the inside of the cochlea. And at that point, what it is, is that there are something called hair cells, which transmit those electrical signals. And over time, as you get older, or if you had hearing damage before, is that those hair cells don't work well. What the cochlear implant does is that it sends electrical signals to the very end of this little, little needle here. Well, not needle. Um, it's the electrical leads. And it provides a, a stimulation that mimics the electrical signal that people would normally have if they had normal hearing. Um, the surgery itself can be anywhere from a one and a half hours to two hours. Um, we make a little cut behind the ear. We put this guy underneath the skin and then we get access to the cochlea itself. We close them up. After a couple of weeks, they will come to our clinic and get activated. So those are kind of the viral videos you see where people are going like, wow, I can hear for the first time. Um, and the idea is that we get a processor. So this is one of the companies. Um, they get it put on for the very first time. It's a little magnet, it sticks, and then that begins their journey. They start, they start practicing with it. They read audiobooks. They listen to YouTube videos. Um, over time, as they use it more and more, they will get better hearing. People say it sounds like a uh, very mechanical or very electronic sounding. And over time, as they practice, the brain gets better and better until they can start having hearing again. So, you know, just kind of want to share. This little cochlear implant thing, I feel like there's not a lot of information or at least YouTube videos about it. So I just wanted to share this little slice of light. Thanks. Bye.